Hey everyone, welcome back to TechTune. In today's video, we are going to guide you step by step on how to install a custom recovery on your Samsung Galaxy Note 9. If you've been wanting to take control of your device, flash custom ROMs or make a full backup, you are in the right place and trust me, it's a lot easier than you think. Before we dive in, let's quickly talk about what TWRP is. TWRP stands for Team Win Recovery Project and it's one of the most popular custom recoveries for your Android device and lets you do things like installing custom ROMs, flashing mods or backing up your entire system. Things that are impossible with a stock recovery. Alright, before we get started, you'll need a few things. A Galaxy Note 9, a Windows PC, the latest TWRP image file, a USB cable to connect your phone to your PC, and a couple of minutes of your time. This won't take long. Now, before you do anything, make sure to back up your data. Installing TWRP and messing with your system can sometimes cause data loss. So back up your contacts, photos, apps, and anything else you can't afford to lose. First things first, unlocking your bootloader. You can't install a TWRP without this step. So let's get that done. Go to your Note 9's settings and scroll down and tap on about phone. And now find software information and tap it. Now tap build number multiple times until you see a message that says you are now a developer. Go back to the main settings screen and you will see a new option called developer options. Now inside developer options, enable OEM unlocking and also scroll down and enable USB debugging. Now put your phone into download mode by first turning it off completely. Once the device is completely turned off, press the volume down button, the Bixby button simultaneously and connect it to a USB cable that is connected to your computer. This will take you into download mode. Once in download mode, press the volume up button to continue and this will take you to the screen. Next, you'll need to install Odin, the tool we'll use to flash TWRP. Go to the link in the description and download Odin on your PC. Once downloaded, unzip the file and run Odin exe as administrator. Make sure your phone is connected to your PC via USB cable. Now download the latest TWRP image file for the Galaxy Note 9. Head to the official TWRP website or a trusted source and search for TWRP for Samsung Galaxy Note 9. Make sure you download the correct version for your model. Once downloaded, save it somewhere easy to find. Okay, so we are almost there. Now let's flash TWRP onto your Note 9. Open Odin on your PC. Once you're here, you can see that my device is added. Now go to options and make sure you uncheck the auto reboot option. You don't want to check that. You should have it unchecked. Now, once that is done, browse and select the TWRP image file you just downloaded. Once it's loaded under the AP tab, click start and wait for Odin to flash the TWRP recovery onto your device. Once it's done, you should see a pass message in Odin, meaning the installation was successful. Now don't reboot your phone just yet. Let's boot into TWRP right after the flash. On your Note 9, press the volume up button the Bixby button and the power buttons together to boot into recovery mode. Now 
Now you should see the TWRP logo on the screen. Congratulations, you have successfully installed TWRP. Now in the TWRP, we have to make a few changes. Swipe to allow modifications and select wipe, format data and type in yes. Once you've done this, select OK and this will format the data of your device. Now, once the formatting is done, if you are into routing your device, you can install Magisk for root access. Hit install and select the Magisk zip file which we moved to the phone and locate it in your device. Select it. Once selected, confirm to flash. Once done, Reboot your phone and you will have root access with Magisk. Now that the device has booted up, let me just quickly complete the setup. Once you are done completing the setup, go into your files app and locate the Magisk APK we just saved onto the phone. Now select the APK and hit install. And once the APK is installed, you are all good to go. Okay, here we are. We have installed Magisk successfully and it's running all good. There you go. You've just installed TWRP on your Galaxy Note 9 and also installed Magisk. And if you followed along, you are ready to start customizing your device from here. And you can also install custom ROMs and even backup your entire phone. If this video helped you, Make sure you hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to TechTune for more awesome videos. If you have any other questions or run into issues, drop a comment below and we'll help you out. Thanks for tuning in and we'll catch you up in the next one.